Hi everyone! This video is to show how to make the scars for the homeless shelter. Once you sign up, you will receive two yards of cloth. The cloth should be folded in half to make a piece that's 40 inches by 60 inches long. Then on the side that's 40 inches long, you can use a tape measure to measure it and then mark out every 10 inches of space. This should give you four marks on this side. The next step is to take a pair of cloth scissors or any scissors and cut all the way down to the other end. This should give you eight long strips of cloth that's 10 inches by 60 inches. When you cut the cloth, it should look like this, and this measures 10 inches by 60 inches long. Now let's cut the fringe at the edges of the scarves. Now at the edge of the scarf, you can measure with a tape measure 4 inches up and mark that spot. And the final step is to cut the fringe at both ends of the scarf. So I'll be showing it how to cut it for one end of the scarf. And after you've cut the fringe, it's relatively thin, then you're done with your scarf and you can do this at both ends. And after you've cut the fringe on both ends of all eight scarves, you're done. And this is how the final product should look like. Thank you for helping out with the Scarves for Charity fundraiser. Thanks everyone! Hi everyone! In this video, I'll be showing you how to tag and label your homemade scars after you make them. The first step is to print out some sayings. It can be any message to cheer up the people who will be receiving the scarves. I chose to say, I was handmade for you. If you are cold and need me, please take me. So after you decide on a saying, you can print it out multiple times and cut out a rectangle. The next step is to use a hole punch and cut out a hole. Then you can keep this to the side for a minute and take your scarf. You can fold in the fringes and roll up the scarf like this. Then after you've rolled it, you can take some string, any type of string will work, and put the, put the saying 
through the string like this. And then you can just put the string around the scarf and tie it with a bow. And before tying it, you can also cut the string. And then your finished product should look like this. Thank you for making them.